Flavor Squad. It's your girl Fashionisha here to give you all the flavor. If you are new here, you are not yet subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you are already subscribed, I thank you for coming back and watching my video. Today we're getting into Taraji P. Henson's new hair care line. I was about to say natural hair care, but it's for all hair types. So we're going to be trying her new TPH hair care line. And I'm so excited to show you guys how it worked on my hair. If you want to know what I feel about these products, how it worked for me, the cost and efficiency of these products, just keep on watching my video. So let's get right into it. Okay, Flavor Squad, I'm just going to start off by rinsing my hair. It's really dirty, so I really need to get a good rinsing before I use her products. I wanted to make sure I started off on semi-clean hair before I got to cleaning my hair. First go in with her Honey Fresh Moisturizing Shampoo. This is my first wash. I'm gonna do two washes. The Honey Fresh Shampoo smelled amazing and it really got my hair clean the first time. Finally going in for my second wash, and I know we all have a little turn up in the shower. I was clearly lit. I'm now going in with her Make It Rain Conditioner. As I was conditioning my hair, I noticed that the conditioner was kind of foaming up. I didn't know what that was about, but it had like a foam texture to it. The foam texture really made me nervous, but once I rinsed it out, my curls felt great. Like the conditioner was good. It was, it was good. Okay, Flavor Squad, you just saw me wash my hair with Taraji P. Henson's new hair products, TPH. And I'm going to let you guys know how I feel about each and every product at the end of the video. I'm going to rate each and every product, let you know what it is, and let you know how much each product cost it. Whew. Okay, I'm going to use Taraji P. Henson's TPH tough cookie a style defining gel slick shape define and it's for curly and coily hair so I'm going to use that to twist my hair today I'm also going to use her detangling leave-in conditioner I detangle my hair pretty well in the shower but I really do want to have a leave-in conditioner for my twist out so I'm going to use her ride or die ride or die a detangling leave-in conditioner on my twist out as well um she had an oil but I don't know. I was reading it and I was just feeling too skeptical to buy it for $10. So I did not get the oil. I'm going to be using my regular black castor oil on my hair today to lock in my leave-in conditioner. I'm going to show you guys my curls after the wash. This is what they're looking like right now. This 
has a really minty smell and it's the spearmint that it's spearmint is inside of the ingredients I don't really know if that's a good thing this is just my personal opinion I really really don't like spray leave-in conditioner it's just I don't know I'm probably just impatient so I just want my conditioner now like oh why I gotta spray <laughs> but whatever let's look at the curls the curls are pretty nice so far the feel of this it's okay like I've, I've had better feels of conditioner leave-in conditioner but it's okay it's curl style okay flavor squad i'm gonna get started with twisting my hair using her tough cookie styling gel i'm gonna first just make sure i add some castor oil to my hair to lock in the moisture from the leave-in conditioner I'm gonna go in with her Tough Cookie Styling Gel. It's really jelly. Can y'all see that? That's like really jelly. This is infused with Boabop, <laughs> flaxseed, and castor oil. Okay. Reading castor oil just made me think that I almost forgot my dog on oil, y'all. I almost forgot my oil. Just gonna go in with just a little castor oil. Nothing too much. I don't want to overpower her products, but I do want to add some oil to my hair. Now I'm gonna go in with her styling gel. And this is especially for curly and coily hair. So I hope this works out well. not a lot of frizz which is a good thing it seems like it's really holding like a gel should let me show you I like it I really like it feels good smells good curls are bouncy look at that I like it I feel like I would do a wash and go on this I really want to twist my hair so that's what we're gonna do today if you guys would like to see a detailed twisting tutorial for a twist out how to get the perfect twist out make sure you click the link in my description below I did a video with texture ID on how to get the perfect twist out because I'm not going to go into detail on my twist out in this video It looks really, really good. Like, really good. I'm surprised. I am surprised. I'm just surprised because, you know, when celebrities bring out hair products, you just never know how that's going to work out. Most of them are only bringing out hair products because they know we're going to buy it. They know if they hype it up, especially for naturals, we're going to buy it. And their products end up not being the best, like the trash. But that's the thing, you can't you can't finesse a natural. Yes, we're gonna buy it one time, but we'll never buy it again if it's not good. So Taraji girl, I'm rooting for you. Right now, 
I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and twist the rest of my hair and I'll be right back to let you guys know what I feel about the twist, what I think. And then we're gonna take it down and tell you guys what I think about each and every product that I've used today. So, I'll be right back. This is what my twists were looking like once I was finished. They were really bouncy. I like that they were bouncy, but they didn't give me that really juicy like twist type of feel that a cream gives and I know it's probably because it's a gel so it's expected of a gel I'm just adding a little more castor oil to my twist before I dry my hair Here I'm going in with my blow dryer bonnet thingamajig, yeah, that I got from my local beauty supply store. And this is what we're looking like once it's all done drying. I'm just going to take it all down let you guys see how it came out. Yes, ma'am. The curls were popping. My hair was bouncy. I really loved how it was looking. I really, really loved it. I think Taraji might be on to something here. Okay, Flavor Squad, this is the finished look of me using Taraji P. Henson's new TPH hair products. I'm going to just go through and show you guys what I used and how I feel about each product. So the first product I used is the Honey Fresh Clarifying Shampoo. The shampoo is bomb. It gets a 9 out of 10. And I say a 9 out of 10 because the second time I washed my hair, it felt like... It was just so dry like really really dry after the second time i used it but the first time i really felt like my hair was clean it was soft and that's basically what i want clean hair when i'm shampooing my hair so that was really good that was a 10 out of 10 and this product was ten dollars 9.99 at target second product i used was make it rain conditioner now the conditioner when i wash my hair as i was putting it in my hair running my fingers through it, it wasn't very much slippage. I really didn't think it was gonna do good at all. But once I let it sit in my hair and then I rinsed it out, it was good. So I'll give this like a seven out of 10 cause it really scared me. And then it had that little foam texture. I've never seen a conditioner have. So yeah, I have to give that a seven. And this was also $9.99 at Target. The next product I used was the Ride or Die Leave-In Conditioner. This, I would probably not buy this again because it really didn't do much for me. I don't think it did much. I didn't feel the moisture. I didn't feel like this was really giving me conditioned vibes, you know. I wasn't really feeling conditioned. So, I probably won't use this again. I'll probably give this like a 5 I mean, it is a leave-in conditioner, so maybe a five. <clears throat> this was also $9.99 at Target. The last product I used was Tough Cookie, the styling gel. I love the styling gel. This is probably my favorite one. I'm going to have to give this one a 10 out of 10. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. 
Labor Squad, the next day, I noticed my hair was flaking really, really bad. It was just like my hair was snowing. I don't know if you can see it in the video, but I tried to catch it. The hold wasn't horrible. I really liked how it made my curls pop, no frizz. So I have to give this one a 10 out of 10. This was also $9.99 at Target. Now overall, I really love how my hair feels. My hair is really, really soft right now. My curls are popping. And I think that's the most important part. Are your curls looking good? Are they feeling healthy? They do feel healthy. They really do feel good. It feels soft. I feel like I would use these again, maybe. I don't know. I might give it away, let somebody else use it because I'm so stuck on the products that I already use. I don't want to move, in, move into anything new right now, so. I really do love this though. I would give the whole line as a whole mm, a seven. I'll give the whole line as a whole a seven. I have to give it a seven because number one, it is pricey. I feel like $10 for something like a leave-in conditioner is very expensive. Um, the conditioner wasn't the best. I just didn't, I wasn't feeling it once I was putting it on. I was really nervous. Like I really wanted to stop and grab my Aussie Moist, but I didn't. But this styling gel boosted up a little bit because it was bomb. So all, all in all, I give it a seven out of 10. Um, I would recommend you use it. I don't think it's a horrible product. Um, the shampoo and the conditioner were for all hair types and the uh, no, the shampoo conditioner and the leave-in conditioner were for all hair types. And the styling gel was the only one that was for curly and coily hair. I don't know if that's why I loved it so much or what, but I love that one. So that's all I have for you guys today. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe and leave a comment down below what you think of my hair. Do you think that, that her products did my hair justice or no? Let me know what you think down below. Make sure you hit that subscribe button once again and make your curls pop and your grind never stop.